All right, guys, so testing out the Sportsman Gen 3500i. Hopefully you can hear me because I'm in a uh, really confined space with it, uh, but still pretty quiet. What I'm going to do here today is do a maximum uh, rated load test. This generator is rated for 3,500 watt surge, 3,000 watts running, so we're going to do the uh, 3,000 watts via two 1,500 watt uh, space heaters and uh, see if this unit actually lives up to its claims. Because a lot of times uh, with these units, I notice um, with some of the third party units that aren't Honda or Yamaha, they don't live up to their claims. They can't reach their uh, rated wattage, whereas the Hondas and Yamahas can. So uh, let me go ahead and uh, see if this unit can. What I have set up here is I have one unit, the small unit here, or the newest unit, running into the RV adapter and that uh, that has an RV adapter to a regular 120 volt plug and then I have the uh, old unit here that's probably 20 years old uh, running into the 20 amp adapters now the reason I'm doing this is because it's rated for uh, for 20 amps with this adapter here and it may trip the circuit breaker and this one's rated for 30 amps so I'm um, just splitting the load so that I don't trip the circuit breaker on the regular uh, two uh, 120 volt outlet sides. So I'm going to plug in the old one. Uh, actually, before I do this, let's go ahead and see how loud it is right next to the unit. If uh, my batteries are working here, I do have dollar store batteries in. All right. So 74 right next to it, which in this confined area is still pretty quiet. Um, it's rated for 63 decibels, 23 feet away. And I've tested it before. It does meet that or exceed it. So um, let's go ahead and get the load test done. And I'll back out show you how loud it is because it gets pretty loud. So turn this 1500 watt on first, then that one. Uh, let's take it out of eco mode. One of them, 86 decibels, quite a bit louder. Turn on the other one, 80. so full load, full 1500 watts. It's extremely loud. I mean, extremely, extremely loud. We'll go back to 23 feet. And uh, that's like a day and a night difference. Just under 80 decibels at 23 feet. So while it is quieter than a normal generator under low loads, So while it is uh, quieter than a normal generator, under low load, something 1500 watts or under, because uh, it's fairly quiet at 1500 watts, I've tested it with uh, just one space heater, tested it with a 12,000 BTU air conditioner, it stays fairly quiet, uh, but once you get into, you know, a max load is actually a little bit louder than my standard uh, 3000 watt alternator style generator, uh, that unit generally stays in the uh, in the mid 70s somewhere between 72 and 75 decibels at 23 feet uh, with that type of load on it and this unit is quite a bit louder uh, at 79 decibels and the reason for that is that this unit is allowed to um, to free rev uh, it revs up to around 5,000 rpms or 5,500 uh, because it's an inverter style generator, it doesn't have to spin at 3600 RPMs to maintain, um, you know, voltage and hertz. So, my other unit has a larger displacement engine, even though it's rated for the same wattage, it has a 196 cc. This one's 149.5 cc, so uh, it's a little bit louder at full low, but uh, for most cases, what I use it for in emergency situations is maybe running one space heater in the winter 
My laptop and lights, it generally stays under 2,000 watts where it's fairly quiet, quieter than a normal generator. Of course, using less wattage than that, it'll be even quieter. Uh, but I don't foresee myself using a full load, but I can uh, probably guess that someone running a, a large air conditioner may run near a full load for a few seconds, and then the unit would quiet down as the surge load of that air conditioner goes down. So, as long as you're not fully loading it, most people aren't going to be using 3,000 watts unless they're, uh, they're using this generator for something like a, um, a pool pump or something heavy that has to run at a high load all the time. Uh, besides that, it's fairly quiet. Even with just one, uh, one of these space eaters, it's fairly quiet. So, not that loud, but once you put that second one on there, it gets really loud. Alright guys, hopefully you enjoyed this uh, full load test of the Sportsman Gen 3500i. Uh, it does meet its full load unlike uh, some other generators that are even more popular than it that uh, actually don't get anywhere near their full load. They'll quit out, you know, three, four hundred watts before their rated load. Uh, this guy maintains it. I've done this test before. Uh, it does not shut off you know after a minute or two it continues to run it uh, but then again I don't run it that long because it is extremely loud so as always guys thanks for watching I'll see you guys later peace